I hope you know that not everyone will jackpot with student route. Yes, you, Obi. It is you I am talking to. Why are you running? With the financial commitment that is too much, at least not with the recent exchange rates or the form A Wahala. Let's face it, the financial burden is way too much. Well, <laughs> drums roll. I have a better route for you. So, Obi, come closer. Come closer. Ensure that you stay till the end of this video because I'll be spilling it all. <laughs> Hello and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Esther Ogala and my pronouns are she and her. <laughs> I've just been meaning to do this year on a lighter note. Anyways, welcome to the family. I have a welcome from the you're old welcome. members. Yeah, you heard it right. Welcome. Please ensure that you hit the subscribe button. It is totally free. Hit the subscribe button to be part of this amazing family where you get tips and opportunities as international students in the UK, health and beauty tips, lifestyle vlogs. So if this is one of the things that you like you'd want to stay here if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back you are the real MVP today's video is centered around a new visa route which was introduced in April 2023 for non UK residents to come in and do business in the UK this visa called the innovator founder visa has now replaced what was formerly known as the innovator route and startup visa this visa is now a primary visa category for business owners entrepreneurs from foreign countries looking to come into the uk and set up businesses are you an innovator or an entrepreneur with innovative business idea then the innovator founder visa is screaming your name first purpose of this visa is aimed at non-eea nationals with business ideas or best put foreigners with business ideas that are endorsed by a uk endorsing body to be eligible for this visa your business has to be innovative scalable and should have the potential to create jobs and contribute to the UK economy. Well, to be fair, it still will always boil down to the UK economy. It's like a win for win. I am giving you something and I am taking something back. You feed me, I feed you, and we are both eating off each other. Now, okay, you have heard what this visa is about and you're like, okay, please tell us about the process. Now, this is the process. The application for the innovative founder visa are in two stages. First stage will be securing an endorsement from an endorsing body, obviously, which has to be from the UK. Just to confirm the valuability and the innovation of your business idea. Once you receive that endorsement, you can now proceed to apply for visa, which is going to be in your home country, say Ghana, Nigeria, Kenya, Sierra Leone, India, Pakistan, wherever it is. So you getting this endorsement from the UK endorsing body is what you need to add as your supporting document to apply for your visa in your home country. You need at least £1,270 to be kept in your account for 28 consecutive days before applying for this visa. And this visa allows you to stay up to three years initially in the UK. And after three years, if your business is successful, can be you came to sell rice in the UK and you made it, yeah? After the three years where you get to set up your business, do your business and all sorts, if eventually your business kicks and yeah you're contributing to the economy you know everything is going well you may now be able to apply for settlement which is like your indefinite leave to remain in the uk which offers you a pathway to residency okay you're asking you're saying you have told us about 
what the visa is about you've told us the application process what is the benefit go go what can we get from this this visa oh yeah wait let me tell you these benefits that you stand to get if you use the innovator founder visa innovative founder visa offers several benefits and one is the opportunity the freedom to work on your business full time so there's no restriction to say 20 hours and um, 40 hours you are free to work full time as your body can carry it as your business requires you are free to work full time without necessarily needing additional employment from somewhere else number two is you can also bring your dependents so from next year which is 2024 um there's a restriction of bringing your dependents if you're coming to do masters and all that has been scrapped totally on the student route visa except you're doing a doctorate that's the only way that you can bring your dependent but with the innovative founder visa you can bring your dependent with you obviously the endorsing body will only endorse those that have proved that they have funds to carry out these businesses that they say they have ideas for or they are innovative about so if you're a talented innovative person go ahead and prepare a strong business plan and showcase how your innovation will make an impact in the uk if you found this video interesting please and please give it a like and also drop a pink heart yes a pink heart in the comment section i want to know the subscribers that are really subscribers you know what i mean yeah because something is coming up on this channel and i would like to know the people that should shouldn't get some of the goodies if you know you know hit the subscribe button if you haven't i don't even know why you haven't by now please ensure that you hit the subscribe button it is totally free please and please hit the subscribe button now turn on your notification bell so that you get notified every time that i post a video share this video to whoever you think might need this information and until i see you in my next one keep on being amazing keep on being fantastic keep on doing you and keep on loving you love and light always guys bye I want to